In today's video, we're gonna be taking Zelda into Va Lizard. Oh, we better get in there before okay. we burn to death. We are just fine. Oh, and it is dark. Wow. Oh my gosh. Dark it's and like scary a, with a fairy. It's like Bram Stoker's Dracula. This uh, just got dark. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, yeah, we're playing Zelda, except we're Zelda, not Link. Yeah, and we Breath have the cool wild, but outfits Zelda. we can wear. And uh, one of our viewers actually recommended that we dress up as Femme Tingle <laughs> during this uh, <laughs> during this part of the game. So uh, yeah, this is uh, this is gonna be Femme Tingle's. Uh, Trist into <laughs> Va Radania. <laughs> so it's Tingle's hood, the phantom uh, breastplate, yeah, armor, um, shirt, basically, and then uh, no pants. No pants. Right, that's Fan Tingle, as in Phantom Ganon slash Tingle <laughs> in Breath of the Wild, which but is your link. Which is an old fan favorite. Fan being spelled P H A N. Yeah, fans love the fan. Tingle. We're gonna need this torch. Uh, but we're gonna be we're gonna be going through this uh, divine beast, and I think that Ted could pull off the whole divine beast in a single. Yeah. Oh, definitely, dude. I'm fast at this one. And whether you are uh, new or not new around here, we do want to welcome you back to the basement. We are the friendliest place on YouTube, and uh, we love Nintendo. We play a lot of Breath of the Wild, and we're gonna have a real good time today shooting this dork in the eye. Oh. Okay, all right, just a minute. We're Take. gonna... Hold on now. In the dark. Yes. Take that, buddy. Zelda wins. That's... You can't see her win, because that would be too easy. Reminds me of playing catch with a baseball in the backyard with my dad when I was a kid. I'd throw it to him, and he'd swing his shield and bash it back <laughs> bash at me. It into it'd, your forehead? It would hit me right in the eye. Oh, and then you'd like disappear into a cloud of blue electric dust? Yeah, and my it, I only have one eye. Oh, I hate it when this happens. Yeah, and then the ball would hit me and I would... Well, you had two eyes, but you played a couple times. <laughs> and then, and then, like, I had no memories. It just instantly, it was a blood moon and I was waking up like it was the next day. <laughs> Dude, uh, I think you had the same child that I did. <laughs> Dude, this this part of the game was so cool the well, first time you play through there it. Sh there should have been more pitch black stuff in this game. I yeah. Think. It been yeah, going around fun. with a torch in the dark. I mean, think about it. It's so Zelda-y. The original Legend yeah! of Zelda. You would yeah, go into yeah. the next room and the screen would go to black and then you'd use the candle and it would just spit fire out of Link's, like, torso. <laughs> oh, and you could get hurt. You the know original Zelda's a weird game, because you could get hurt by your own candle, but you couldn't get hurt by your own bombs. That is really weird. And then weird. Nintendo's like, you know what? Bombs hurt, candles don't. <laughs> you know what? We got it wrong. Got yeah, it backwards. The other way around. <laughs> oh, it should have been a zero. I put a one in the code. They made it backwards. That's how code works, right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, there is a bit flipped. Um, in... Zelda? Uh, the... Right. Super Nintendo version of some Disney game. And it wasn't in the Sega Genesis version of the game. Was it like in Aladdin or... Yeah, something like that. Or, or Lion, Lion King? King? Might have been Lion King. And it fed the rumor, and now this is technically true, that um, the Genesis, I think, had more... Or was it the other way around? That the Genesis had... Oh... No, the Genesis had more uh, audio tracks. Okay. And the Super Nintendo had fewer, I think is what it was. This is an interesting tidbit. And a so, bit of trivia. It Pay was attention, like trivia. Down, or maybe it was the NES or whatever. I don't know. But anyway, you'd get like, like in the Lion King, the lion in the game is the king has returned. Rafiki says that. The king has returned. Right, and it sounds like yes. that on the one console, and on the other, it's like. <laughs> it sounds like a Nintendo problem. <laughs> <laughs> well, I exaggerated. Well, it didn't have that blast bit. processing. Exactly. No, that's nothing. It's almost nothing. You know this trick. <gasps> no! You knew that trick. Like a like a femme tingle through the eye of a camel lizard in a <laughs> in a volcano. I wish there was a trick like that in the camel. <gasps> Ow, I lit my arrow, but I also lit myself. Dude. Oh, I missed. Video ID idea. I hate this bow. These bows, the phrenic bows. 
The ones that zoom in. Yeah. Oh, the soldier bows apparently do it too. Because you can't see what you're doing. Um, Bible themes in Breath of the Wild. Bible themes? Well, yeah, like a camel through the eye of a needle. Oh, like make a video like telling the Bible story through the Breath of the Wild. Yeah, just any, or like, Ooh, and the developers put this here as a reference to Mark 38. <laughs> And see how many comments you get where people actually know that there is no 38th chapter in the book of Mark. <laughs> I wouldn't have been able to tell you that. Well, I'm guessing, but I'm confident anyway. It's a short one, right? I think 11 chapters. Mark? There are three. Yeah. I think John's the shortest one. I'm not sure how long they are, though. Actually, honestly. I know Luke was a doctor. Yes. And Matthew was a fisherman. And John was the most beloved of all the disciples. Or at least he thought so. If that were true, then why did Jesus build his church upon the Peter? Well, have you ever tried to run a church? Have you That's ever tried to... That's the worst job. <laughs> <laughs> Deny me three times, will you? Feed my sheep! <laughs> oh man! I'm giving you the worst job of all. <laughs> feed all... Feed 99 of the found Do sheep. Do I really gotta? Feed my sheep. <laughs> Do I really? What did I just say? <laughs> <laughs> what? A, feed all the sheep where the sun shines. All what about the land. that dark part over there? <laughs> what did I just say? Dude, you're good at this divine beast. <clears throat> I can do it with my eyes closed. In fact, my eyes have been closed this whole time. That's Peter, you true. can attest. <laughs> well, that is true, but uh, Ted had uh, transparent eyelids <laughs> implanted. <laughs> I'm like I'm three like months frog. ago, <laughs> so he could uh, he could uh, I am stream a, I'm a, endlessly. I'm a, I'm a chimera. <laughs> <laughs> now that his next cosmetic surgery is to get an extra long tongue implanted, so he can lick his own eyeballs without taking his hands <laughs> off the controllers. So that way, I can make sure they're nice and moist. <laughs> Ted does spend a lot of time taking his hand off the controller and touching his face. He's doing it right now, dude. Yeah, when they like. Pandemic stuff. They're like, don't touch your face. I'm like, I'm gonna die. Yeah, <laughs> I touch my face so much. A lot of people do, and most people don't realize they're doing it as much as they are. I think most people think they do it a little, and most people are just really far off. <laughs> are you saving that last regular arrow? Yeah, in case we need to light it on fire or something, because you never know. But we have fire arrows. Yeah, but like, what if I need to do something that isn't fire arrow? -y? Like a blue fire. Oh. You can't light a blue fire arrow on fire. Can, well, can you write a... Wait, I'll bet you can. Light a red fire arrow, blue? No. Have you, you tried? Can't. No, because it doesn't start on fire until after it's like in the air. It's like magically imbued. What? On the front of... The, yeah. No. You'll see, Like when you hold it out, it's different from an arrow being on fire. It's like got this glowy red magic fire on the front. And then when you let go of it, then it's a then it's an arrow that's on fire. Zelda Zelda has a really nice pair of ears. Yeah, they're very pointy. <laughs> oh, no, we're on fire out here. Okay, we're trying to switch it back to this upgraded flame breaker. Wait, we didn't upgrade this one twice. Oh. Must not have had enough stuff for it. Now we have to go back to last week's video. Oh man! Oh no! My wooden shield woke. Dude, you gotta pay attention. I take back what I said about you being really good at this. Well, I'm good at this. I'm and I'm going to replace it with you're really very good at this, except for the part where you don't. Okay, before we go down part. and take care of that. Dude, your torch is on fire. Well, that's not so bad. Well, we're gonna take care of this while we're up here. What's that, Ted? Are you gonna sequence break? No, there's just there's a. One of the, um, what are they called? The goopies? Not goopies. You gotta but shoot the eyeball? No, the things that you gotta touch. Yeah, the, the turn, the, like, the shrines within the thing. The waypoints. Yeah, what are they called? What are they called? Terminals. Ah. Four terminals remain. Um, one of the terminals is up here on the stegosaurus tips. But you gotta... one is it oh it's this one it's right there see it yeah I do see it dude these uh these little objectives in this divine beast are like my illness terminal that's okay <laughs> I'm trying to do the joke you taught me about last week yeah 
<laughs> Aren't yeah, terminal are. illness jokes funny? <laughs> They're pretty funny. <laughs> my, my terminal illness is life. It has a 100% chance of death. <laughs> Virtually 100%. I guess Virtually. Enoch and Elijah didn't die. Uh, yeah, even Jesus died. Even Jesus died. For a while. Um. <laughs> that sounds so funny when you say it like that. He died for a little while. Uh, the, uh, uh, what was what? I gonna say? Oh, uh, uh, what's his name? Lazarus died twice. Oof. Can you imagine? No. I wonder. I can only imagine. <laughs> it's really interesting, though, because he got to die. Okay, so if anyone doesn't know, Lazarus died. And then in the Bible and IRL. According to what I believe, uh, Jesus made him alive again, brought him back to life, and then later on, I assume he died again at some point. Yeah, He's still wandering around. Just the second time, it wasn't like extraordinary. They're just like, yeah, it's just like everybody else. He died. But for him, was he thinking like, oh, I was just like falling asleep. He's like, I like, already did this once. Yeah, he knows. Everyone else that faces death well, he is probably, like, I don't know. He what, died how this young is turn the first out. time because he got sick. I wonder if he like died in a less like cruddy way. Because like dying from getting sick doesn't sound fun. It's not. You know? Well, but like, what's on the <clears throat> other side of death, right? That's what. You know, you talk about near death experiences. How about actual death experiences, and then being alive to talk about it? Like Check somebody should have interviewed him, made a documentary about him. On Netflix or or Pureflix, Pureflix. That's right. That's Do you know who owns Pureflix? Um, Mark Burnett. Sony. What? Yep. Sony owns Pureflix. Here's the thing. I was I was listening Do, to. I, it's. I mean, there's a market. It's there's a market out that's there. That's the thing. I was listening to a little chat uh, on the internet about this, and uh, we were having like surprisingly zero conversation about Zelda. Just so you know, so people who are here for Zelda content, they're watching Zelda and listening to something totally different. <laughs> oh no! Well, now you're here for uh, Blight. Fire Blight. Flame Blight. What's his name? Lava Blight? Fire... <laughs> Hot Blight! Volcano Blight Ganon. Watch yourself now. The air conditioning How hot is broken. Is it? It's so hot! I woke up this morning and realized that I looked just like Fireblight Ganon. <laughs> He's got clown hair. That's scary. <laughs> I'm going to get you. <laughs> Uh-oh. We're on 60 FPS, aren't we? Is that this problem? might cause some problems, bro. Uh-oh. Did I tell my crash joke in this episode or in the previous one? Probably the previous one where you were trying so hard. Oh man, we only had one uh, Methuselah. Dude, I don't, Ursula, I don't need Ur Urbosa. I don't need Methuselah Burbosa <laughs> skills for this. All right, all right. Hit him with two. Just hit him with two bombs. He falls over. Glorp. So I'm just worried that he's gonna like Dude, when he fly turns into a very ball, far away. He glorps. I wonder if Arlo would agree. I'm sure Arlo would think he's glorping. That's for sure. Oops. He just glorps right up there. Okay, I'll be fired by Ganon. <laughs> it's so hot today. How hot is it? <laughs> it's so hot. When I woke up, I was already my second form. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. <laughs> that was good. Yeah. Good for me. Oh, good for you. You got an orange blade? We got a blue blade. How you like them apples? So anyway, Pureflix is owned by Sony. <laughs> That's so crazy. Because Hollywood realized that there's a market for Christian movies, but then they didn't do it very well because they made, like, Christian movies that were bad. Well, Dumb. and they didn't like, they offended Christians. Oh, yeah. You know? Like Noah. Like Noah, right? Like God the flooded the earth for environmental concerns, not sin. 
Right, so the people who are like, I believe what the Bible says, are like, wait, that wasn't right. Environmental concerns are concerning and legit, but they're not, that's, that's they're not, not what the God says, flood yeah. the earth worthy. Well, that doesn't make any sense to anyway. The audience they're trying to appeal to. So, like, you know what? We believe there's a market for this. We also believe that some people make movies that aren't very good production wise, but successful audience wise. So, we'll just back them. We'll buy them, we'll fund them, and they'll make better movies, but they'll make them for the audience that we don't understand. That is good. Dude, look, it's a it's a heart, not a piece of heart. That's a whole heart. That is one whole heart. There's a hole in my heart. <laughs> this uh this level treated us like I treat our YouTube channel. Wholeheartedly. Oh. <laughs> 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 Princess Zelda? Uh, the lizard divine beast. Oh, oh, oh we get a different cutscene. We and get a different cutscene. Dedication to their channel. <laughs> Things that have a whole heart. <laughs> oh. oh. All right, this is gonna be a different cutscene. <laughs> I have spaghetti bur uh, hiccups. Once you activate the main control, you need not be able to enter the vibe. Yes. Oh shoot! I pushed no. Oh. I said yes, but I pushed no. <laughs> ba -da 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 -da. Did you get all that? No. Is that your favorite one? Ba -ba 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 -ba. No, the one. Actually, I saved all the Kirby ones for last. Oh, Bye. I love. Dude, the new Kirby game is gonna be so good, oh, Peter. Oh, I'm really excited okay, for it. Okay, here we go. It different cutscene, different text, good. different talking. What's he gonna say? Let's let's see. Let's find out. I owe you big for this. Because of you, my spirit is finally free. Can't thank you enough. I feel like I should apologize. I was doing all I could to protect Hyrule when that thing got the best of me. Is he gonna say something Sorry different? Me resting with the rubble caused such a mess. Yeah. What is she looking at? Him? Looked like she was spacing out there for a second, looking at the floor. Oh, maybe he didn't say any, use any gendered language, so there's nothing to change here. We'll see. I'm gonna take this down the mountain. I'll have a better shot again in there. And then, once you've made your way into Hyrule Castle, we're gonna light that thing up. It's possible that like something was just clipped out entirely. Yeah. That's possible. Like a shot with a subtitle that has a gender, you know, something like, if, like Yeah, if you said, like, little guy or brother, like, they might have just chopped it out. Because he, he calls Link little guy. You're right. Oh, that looks so cool. I that haven't watched this in forever. does look cool. It looks cool as Zelda doing, like, the... Yeah. I, I Dude, and she's got the golden gauntlets from Ocarina of Time. <laughs> she's like Keanu Reeves. I know, I know Kung Fu. <laughs> <laughs> she just learned it instantly. The power of protection from the depths of my soul now lives inside and my herniated belly button. I invited Daruk in my heart. <laughs> oh, look at that bow. Good luck, tiny princess. <gasps> so there you go. Whoa! That's got to be from like uh, Hyrule Warriors. Maybe. Yeah, tiny princess. I they they've lifted a lot of um. Dude, that was but that's, Hyrule Warrior. Cuts that was and stuff. so smooth. You wouldn't have been able to tell. No, that was incredible. Man, I, I I can't get over it, dude. It's like it's so well done. Did this mod hire voice actors and animators? It feels like it sometimes. Did this mod? Wow, look at that thing. Va lizard. Oh, you know who would be super good at designing outfits for Zelda? My niece. Yeah. She is like a fashion pro. Ooh. I should ask her to do something. I bet if we got. See, here's the cool thing. Keep we could, it down, you loud lizard! We could probably figure out how to uh, have her design something, and we could probably commission oh, some mod it, person. Send it to our uh, the yeah. modder we have on the payroll. <laughs> we don't have one on the payroll, but no. we could commission mods. We, we have one modder that we. Uh, did. did one contract with <laughs> yes, and that was fun. We got a yeah. basement shirt out he, of the deal He did an amazing job and we got minecraft blocks. <laughs> that was so cool Yeah, we should try to think of some cool other mods to, to see if they can be done. That would be fun An epic blast All right, cool. Okay. We got it 
Can I? Oh, that's right. You got to push X and then I'm trying to push minus and then plus because that's how you skip cutscenes in Metroid Dread. Somebody's been playing a little bit of Metroid Dread. Oh, it's so much fun. We recorded five episodes. And we then, did it. And then Ted beat we the, beat the, the game. We beat Va Lizard. Daruk's, Daruk's protection. protection is ready to roll. I think the name of this video should be Zelda destroys Va Lizard. I love that the inside of her hood is blue. Isn't it so good? It feels like it's probably got air conditioning. It it man it really <laughs> brings out the eyes. Oh, you know what else brings out the eyes? A finger. A melon baller. <laughs> <laughs> In the basement.